This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information and to find out how you can volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. Read and recorded by Betsy Bush, Marquette, Michigan, December 2005. The Great Big Treasury of Beatrix Potter. Chapter 10 The Story of Miss Moppet. This is a pussy called Miss Moppet. She thinks she has heard a mouse. This is the mouse peeping out behind the cupboard and making fun of Miss Moppet. He is not afraid of a kitten. This is Miss Moppet jumping just too late. She misses the mouse and hits her own head. She thinks it is a very hard cupboard. The mouse watches Miss Moppet from the top of the cupboard. Miss Moppet ties up her head in a duster and sits before the fire. The mouse thinks she is looking very ill. He comes sliding down the bell pole. Miss Moppet looks worse and worse. The mouse comes a little nearer. Miss Moppet holds her poor head in her paws and looks at him through a hole in the duster. The mouse comes very close. And then all of a sudden, Miss Moppet jumps upon the mouse. And because the mouse has teased Miss Moppet, Miss Moppet thinks she will tease the mouse, which is not at all nice of Miss Moppet. She ties him up in the duster and tosses it about like a ball. But she forgot about that hole in the duster. And when she untied it, there was no mouse. He had wriggled out and run away, and he is dancing a jig on top of the cupboard. End of The Story of Miss Moppet by Beatrix Potter